I'm just about to reveal how you can monetize your Instagram in 2023, so let's get started. Now, just to be clear from the start, some of these methods will be easier, some of them will be a little bit more demanding, but all of them are proven to work. Now, I've actually collected a few case studies for each and every single one of them. That being said, the very first thing you can do to make money on Instagram is actually build a personal brand, which is exactly what Eric Conover here, who's a New York real estate agent has done masterfully. He's been posting reels of his luxury properties that he rents out, and that's how he managed to build a following of 462,000 people, which is insane. Needless to say, people love these reels, they love these videos, and I'm pretty sure he gets a good return in his business and has built a lot of credibility just for his Instagram page. And you can replicate that in any field of activity. It doesn't matter what your profession is, you can certainly leverage social media, capture people's attention, create the following, and that will give you a lot of social proof. But I think we are barely even scratching the surface of what you can do on Instagram in terms of monetization. In fact, I want you guys to just do a quick experiment with me. I've just connected to Google Maps and I've searched for a random place. And now I'm gonna search for a specific business, for instance, a dentist. Well, if I do that and I click on either one of these businesses, they will most likely have an Instagram page that I can check out. I can connect to their website, which any business has, and then I'm pretty sure they will have a link to their social media too. Because businesses in 2022 and 2023 understand the power of social media. Capturing people's attention, getting more eyeballs, getting more traffic, and converting that traffic into potential customers. And I was right. As you can see, I can click on the Instagram icon and that will send me straight over to their Instagram profile where they are just posting updates. And so if you happen to have a physical business such as a dentist or a lawyer's office, you certainly want to leverage social media. You want to create an Instagram page because that will most certainly help you get in front of more people, thus generate more revenue. So this is just another way that you can monetize your Instagram presence. But now guys, let's say that you're not a business owner, perhaps you're not a professional in any field of activity, and you wanna get paid directly by Instagram. Is that actually possible? Can you start an Instagram page and actually get paid by Instagram themselves? Well, it is possible. And that is done through the Instagram Reels Play Bonus, which is an invite-only bonus program that lets you earn money on your Reels content. Let me break it down for you. You see, TikTok was starting to take over the other social media platforms with their short attention-grabbing clips. And so Instagram had to do something about it. And so did YouTube and Facebook. That's why we are seeing YouTube shorts everywhere and there are over 400 million videos. And the same thing is true for Instagram Reels. But they're to give their content creators an incentive to keep posting content these social media platforms are actually willing to pay. And they're pretty generous with that. You see, in order to receive a payout from the Instagram Reels Play Bonus, here's what you need to do. First off, you need to post video content. Not only that, but it has to comply with the community guidelines and their other requirements. To narrow it down, it needs to be original. So if you're just planning on downloading videos from TikTok and reposting them on your Instagram, that is not actually going to get you paid. You cannot repost other people's quality, infringe on their rights, and hopes to get paid for it, because it's not how this works. Most of the content you see online is protected by copyright policy. So that makes it impossible for us to just download videos from a different social media platform and repost them on Instagram, even though that would have been incredibly convenient. We cannot do it. That's why you actually need to put in the work. But at the same time, I do understand the fact that most of you watching this video probably don't want to reveal your face or fool around in front of the camera, do any silly challenges, do any stupid dances. Perhaps that's not for you and that is understandable. So I'm not gonna force you guys to step out of your comfort zone that much in order to get paid on Instagram. You can keep it a lot more simple than that. If you're still watching this video, you are lucky because this is genuinely a unique opportunity that I'm about to cover right now for free. I want you to search for Dylan Anderson on YouTube. You can even search for his profile on TikTok. You see, this content creator has been putting out short videos for about nine months now. And he's been able to get about 3.8 million subscribers in the span of only nine months, which is insane. Not only that, but his channel has generated about 6.4 billion views so far. Now, it says he's been around since 2010 because this account is a little bit older, but if you scroll down to the very bottom of the list of shorts on the channel, you will notice that the oldest one dates back to March 2022. You can actually double check that. But here's the thing about it. He doesn't have to show his face on camera. He doesn't have to record any content. He doesn't need to do stupid challenges or anything of that kind. All he does is just add a commentary, an insightful commentary, 
to these viral clips that he downloads off of TikTok. Let me just play one of these for a few seconds so you can get a better idea. On Thanksgiving Day, this dog was walking on ice when it broke and she fell in the water. He's not trying to be funny. He's not trying to be entertaining. All he does is watch the whole video a few times over. Then he probably checks out the comment section of that original clip too in order to get some more information from some other users. He gets the entire story behind that short clip and then he goes on and narrates the story. He's basically explaining exactly what's going on in real time. And for some reason, People absolutely love this sort of content. They love being explained what's going on. And so just for giving people a little bit of context regarding viral clips, he's been able to generate 6.5 billion views, which is unbelievable. But this is on YouTube. So let me ask you guys something. What's stopping you from doing a very similar thing on Instagram? You can literally find all the viral videos you will ever need on TikTok. You can download them and reuse them on your Instagram page. Now, is that considered original content? Well, let's see. According to fair use policy, you are allowed to use a copyrighted work without the copyright owner's permission as long as you're adding some sort of criticism, comment, reporting, or research to it. In other words, as long as you're adding your own contribution to that original clip and you're not just downloading and reposting, you're not infringing on anyone else's rights. You're allowed to reuse their content. And so there is a very solid chance that your reels will get monetized and you will be eligible for the Instagram Reels Play bonus program that pays users on Instagram for posting short videos. In other words, this is how you can get paid on Instagram directly by Meta without doing too much work. All you need to do is watch viral videos on YouTube, TikTok, and even Instagram, which you're already doing anyway, for several hours a day, then you want to take a moment to try to understand what's going on there, try to get an idea of the backstory of that clip, and then start narrating it. That's all you need to do. You don't have to try too hard to be funny. You don't have to provide an entertaining commentary. You don't have to add any criticism. Just keep it simple. Narrating the facts is all it takes. And Dylan Anderson here is the perfect example of that. By the way, this is not the only channel on YouTube that does that. I cannot give you another one off the top of my head right now, but I'm pretty sure you've seen a few of them if you've been following YouTube Shorts for some time. But now guys, if you're still watching this video, even at this point, I'm about to reveal my personal favorite way of monetizing your Instagram account. It's not about building a personal brand. It's not about building a page for your business or someone else's business. It has nothing to do with the Instagram Reels play bonus, but it has everything to do with building a theme page. Just like this one right here. Now, this one in particular is focusing on the motivational slash entrepreneurial type of content that you see online. We're talking about business ideas, relevant news centered around entrepreneurs, and motivational clips like these ones. The thing about it is that the owner of this page right here never had to show their face on camera, they never had to record any clips, and to be honest, they don't even need to create their own content either, because you can actually take inspiration from other pages, redo the content, and I'm gonna show you how, and you can build yourself an Instagram theme page too. Now, I'm not saying that you can make money with this overnight, but if you're serious about it and if you're using the right strategies, you can make a lot of money with it. And I'll show you precisely how. I'm not sure how many of you knew this about me, but back in the day, I used to manage Instagram theme pages. And these are some of the earnings we've pulled in a little bit over a year. That's $83,000. How did we make that money? Well, it's certainly not ad revenue because that's not how Instagram works. Back then, there were no Instagram Reels either. There used to be only IGTVs, as they call them. Instead, all of this money was generated through sponsorships. And I'll show you what that means. You see, once you build a successful Instagram theme page, especially in the entrepreneurial niche, you gotta ask yourself, what kind of people are following me? Well, most of your audience is composed of people who are genuinely interested in business ideas. They want to make more money. They want to find ways of making money online. And that's the perfect target audience for anyone that's running a coaching business. Here's what I mean. You see, there are a lot of people online who are selling digital or physical products or even services. Likewise, there are a lot of entrepreneurs out there that are selling coaching services. And one of their main ways of promoting their services and communities is by reaching out to these theme pages 
and paying them for a shout out. That is actually a pretty popular way that people advertise their services on Instagram. For instance, this theme page right here has got a little bit over 100,000 followers, which is significantly less than the other one, and they still managed to run a bunch of ads. This entrepreneur is probably paying $50 for an ad on this page, and that is a reasonable amount. You're getting paid $50 per post just to post someone else's content on your profile and promote their services. So once you get to a point where you have built the following, a bunch of entrepreneurs, a bunch of people on social media will reach out to you for shout outs. And that's how you can make a bunch of money on Instagram, by building your own theme page. Now, from my previous experience, I would suggest that you stick to self-development, business, entrepreneurship, this niche. You can also go for fitness, self-help, or things of that kind, spirituality or whatnot. But I genuinely think that this is the most profitable one. I might be wrong, but that's been my personal experience with it. Now, when it comes to creating the content, it's all a matter of finding viral videos online from other pages, other accounts on different social media platforms, giving credit where credit is due and reposting. You're just re-uploading other people's content. You're not hoping to get paid for it by Instagram, but as long as you don't get any copyright strikes or anything like that, and you give credit where credit is due, then you shouldn't have any problems with that. When it comes to creating this quote, all of these posts that you can see here, you can just get someone like a graphic designer to help you by connecting to Fiverr.com and it will not be insanely expensive. Or you can learn to edit this post yourself using Canva. But all in all, there are a bunch of different ways to monetize an Instagram page. Ranging from posting original videos and getting paid directly by Instagram to building a personal brand and helping your business to starting and growing your own Instagram theme page just like this. But I'm going to leave it up to you. So we've got all the resources you need to make this work. Thanks for watching.